Hello, I'm Michael Diamond, and you're watching Muscle Central. Okay, the 2020 Arnold Classic is coming up on us very quickly now. Uh, I'm going to talk a little bit more about it. Let me go over my uh, top seven picks again for that show. I had William Bonac first place. Mom Duels Bay, Big Rami second. Although, um, a, little, a little on the fence with, with that. Uh, Dexter Jackson third. Cedric McMillan fourth. Patrick Moore fifth. Steve Kuklo sixth. And Sergio Oliva Jr. seventh. Now, uh, a little while back I made a video with uh, my Dark Horse uh, prediction. And that happened to be my... Uh, the, my pick for fifth place, Patrick Moore. He's somebody that, depending on the improvements he made from the Olympia and the rest of the competition, the way he come in, he's somebody that can slip right in there and just totally shock everybody and throw a wrench in the placings. I have another dark horse, somebody that you wouldn't necessarily necessarily consider a dark horse. He's my third place pick, Dexter Jackson. As uh, most people know by now, Dexter Jackson announced his retirement. This year, the Mr. Olympia will be his final competition. I am most certain that he didn't just make this decision just now. He more than likely knew it after the last Olympia and has just announced it now. I'm most certain that throughout the whole Arnold prep, he knew this was going to be his final run. One reason why Dexter has lasted so long with his health and, for all we know, injury-free, is that he never really pushed the envelope, never threw caution to the wind. Uh, my hunch is, knowing this is his final run, He's be ha he'll be hanging up the posing trunks. Uh, he'll be willing uh, to push the envelope a bit, uh, throw caution to the wind, and really go to that next level with the supplements and whatnot. Uh, I think... You people watching the video know what I'm, understand what I'm trying to say over here. Uh, Dexter Jackson, if he's willing to, first off, let me say this. He's, he really hasn't showed uh, any signs of slipping in uh, 2018 in Mr. Olympia. When he plays seventh, I think a lot of people were starting to write him off a bit, thinking that, okay, maybe he's reached the point where he's not going to place the, at the top anymore. Came back 2019, uh, the Tampa Pro, it looked terrific. And... Uh, the Olympia, he missed the mark in the pre-judging, but he came back the next day in the finals at a different Dexter Jackson. And if he would have looked that way in pre-judging, the placings might have been a little different. Okay, back to the present. He hasn't shown signs of slipping at 50 years of age. If he's willing to push the envelope for this final year like I think he just might. I mean, it's a short period of time. 
not not enough time for him to create any health issues for going in, going that uh, extra mile. Uh, he might come in looking, dare I say, somewhat freaky. Dexter Jackson, even at 50 years of age, uh, is dangerous. Uh, if Rami or Bonac don't come in as sharp as they need to be, Dexter Jackson, knowing it's his final run, and if he's willing to push it to that point, he's somebody who can slip in there and take it and walk away with one more auto classic victory under his belt. Uh, I don't think it's going to be uh, his last show before the Olympia either. I got a feeling between the Arnold Classic and Olympia, he's going to want to really go out in style, and there's going to be a few more shows. And uh, then he'll hang it up. Let me know what you think about this video in a comment, what I said in this video in a comment section. If you agree or disagree with what I've said, I would like to know. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please share and by all means subscribe. Do not forget to hit that notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, you will be notified. Once again, this is Michael Diamond, and I'd like to thank you for watching. Muscle Central.